Cam, uh, second half, um, you guys really turned it on. At halftime, as you guys are coming back out, I had an opportunity to talk to your head coach, Jess Quinn, and he said he couldn't understand why in the first half you guys were taking the ball to the rim and, and then dishing it at the last second. You guys seemed to fix that in the second half. Uh, was that his message at halftime to you guys? Yeah, that's exactly what it was. Um, he said two feet pass, two foot pass, they don't do anything for us. If the defense collapsed, they're just going to get the ball and be trapped there, and that's not going to do anything for us. So they basically just told us to take it up and get fouled, so that's what we did. Uh, you know, you knew you guys couldn't win the KSAC North, but you knew they had a chance at it. Uh, do uh, some of your friends over at CL owe you guys dinner now? Uh, <laughs> uh, you could say they can. I mean, we just wanted to win regardless. I know uh, they beat us last time. That was our main focus, getting that revenge. But it, however it plays out is how it plays out. Uh, the fact that you guys weren't going to be in the KSAC championship game, was this kind of like your tune-up for the playoffs? Yeah, that's exactly what our message was at the beginning of the game. He said, this is going to be a hostile environment. We're going to have to do that first round. We're probably going to have to travel the way it's looking. So he said to come in and play our hearts out, get the win. So it's exactly like a playoff game to us. Talk about your defense in the third quarter, especially Austin Hummel. I had him for four steals in the quarter. That really seemed to turn things around when you guys went to your full court press and were able to get not only turnovers but points off those turnovers. Yeah, all credit to Austin, all credit to the other players on the team. I mean, we got deflections after deflection, and we talked about that in the, in, at halftime too. Our pressure was really low, so we increased that. And shout out to Spence too. He did a great job guarding Nate the whole game. Uh, and you, you got hot from the outside there in the third quarter. What was it that you started seeing yourself uh, in taking those shots? Well, I know that uh, my teammates have the trust in me. My coaches do. He just said, hey, if you're feeling it, shoot it. I hit the one, and then I was feeling it after that. And... Uh, since the last time uh, we had an opportunity to talk, you scored your 1,000th point last week against Venango Catholic. I wanted to say congratulations on that. What was that like, and what does that just say about your career? That's it's, un uh, I can't even describe it. That moment was so special. Um, all my friends, my family, all my family was there. It was just, it was amazing. Um, just, that's every player's, that's every player's dream. Every player's goal to score that 1,000. Be able to do that, it's just unbelievable. Well, congratulations on that, Cam, and congratulations on this big win tonight, and good luck as you guys head into the playoffs. Thank you.